The Wars on Mobile has been delayed until 2024. But don't worry, there's a new game coming out in a few weeks that's very, very similar. Yes, that's right. Project Bloodstrike, or now known as just Bloodstrike, will be launching at the end of this month on October 28th, boys and girls. You can see here the official release date on the iOS store, and it is an absolute banger of a game. So if you guys don't know what Bloodstrike is, it is basically an advanced battle royale. It looks very, very similar to Warzone Mobile, but it has a sort of futuristic feel with Apex Legends vibes as well. It's got different characters, it can use different abilities, and and it has a ton of cool looking weapons as well. This game has got multiple game modes, it's got battle royale, it's got multiplayer, and it's one of the most optimized games you will ever play on your mobile device. And no, I am not just saying this for the video. It's smooth. Real smooth. So firstly, I really apologize for the lack of videos the past week and for my voice. When I got back from the Call of Duty Next event in LA last week for Warzone Mobile, I got sick and I've been in bed this past week. But I feel a bit better today, but talking about the Warzone Mobile event, yes, you guys know it's been delayed until spring 2024. That means we've got another sort of six to eight months until we actually get our hands on that game. So Bloodstrike has come at a perfect time because it offers very similar experience, but... It has full optimization. So Bloodstrike has been in soft launch in Brazil for the past month or so, and it's only been available on Android. But I've been speaking closely with the devs, and they are preparing the global launch for October 28th. Okay, so I've got my hands on the soft launch, and this is what the current lobby looks like. It looks really clean. It's not like over cluttered or anything as well. This is on Android, but they got so much stuff in the game already, and all of the stuff that you play in soft launch is going to save over to global launch as well, so you don't even have to start a new grind. They basically got new weapons they've got a new battle pass right here called a strike pass i mean every mobile game gets a battle pass so i'll let you guys experience that when you actually get the game you can actually get this katana by sharing some codes right now so if you've got three if you actually play the soft launch right now um i don't think you can get this in global launch but if you share your three codes on the right hand side right there if you guys want to enter your codes into this box on the top right then I can get myself a free katana and you guys can do it too. So share your codes in the comments down below to get a free katana. Uh, basically, this game is pretty amazing. It's got a battle royale ranked. It's got battle royale normal. It's got squad fight, which is basically multiplayer hard point. And it's got hot zone, which is basically arenas four versus four. And it's got a firing range. It's, at, it's basically got everything you need in a mobile game like it's pretty amazing it's got the loadouts it's got every single weapon that you can customize loadouts to go in the game with so it's very similar to warzone so many different weapons as well look at all these weapons they've got they've got snipers they've got smgs you can rotate them you can do everything the game feels just super smooth they've even got leaderboards in the game as well on bronze 2 at the moment haven't really grinded but they've also got a ranked leaderboard with some insane rewards at the end of it as well so the game feels and looks amazing it's got uh, nine different sort of characters or legends that you can use at the moment each of them have got different abilities like this guy's got a vortex this guy can bust out a shield i'm gonna go into more detail on that in the future video because you know the global launch isn't actually here yet but i'll uh, i'll go into more in depth on which is the best characters to use and the best weapons to use for you guys but let's just hop in the firing range just so i can show you some uh, just basically how smooth this is but it feels really, really good, guys. Like, for a mobile game, it apparently it runs at 3 gigabytes. On any 3 gigabyte RAM device, it runs 60 FPS. Now, obviously, I'm on the Red Magic 8S Pro. This is ultra graphics, and it's 90 FPS. Feels absolutely incredible. Looks incredible. And I just can't fault it. Like, I've been playing this game for a while now, and I just, I just think it's such an optimized game it is such a fun experience and this is what most mobile games should be like like this is probably what we expect walls and mobile to be like when it actually launches like this sort of smoothness a lot of people think that's not going to happen i believe it can happen uh the walls and devs are doing great things but 
in the meantime, you know, we've, we're going to have this game to grind for six months. So I'm going to show you some gameplay just to show you exactly how smooth it is. So thank you for watching. Check this out. Literally got slow cancelling as well. Oh man, it feels so smooth. Disgusting. Oh my god, you made the S in so quick. Alright, maybe not. Wait, it's sniping one shot. Shit, bro. Ooh, nice little four piece at the end. Damn, man, this game feels so freaking optimized, man. All right, we're going snipes again, boys. I think this is the only map that they actually have in multiplayer, so they're probably going to add more maps, but I can't wait for you guys to actually try this out because it is the smoothest game ever. Anyway, let's hit some more domey snipes. Enemy hit. Enemy oh, a one shot. Whiffing hard. Enemy hit. Vortex blast and get. Taking hit. Damn, bro, I was already weak. Leave me alone. Protection barrier up and running. Yeah, the ADS is weird when it comes off the uh, off the snipe. I, I mean, it still feels clean, but. Come on, Pete. Salin. Satellite scan in progress. Taking hit. What? Bro, I just cleaned you to the head, bro. How do you survive that? Fucking bot. Ooh, there it is. Do we get a kill cam as well? I don't think you get a kill cam. I think that is actually being added in Global though, if they had a kill cam. I'm going to request that. Uh, There we go, boys. Nasty. The game feels incredible, but Global Launch is coming soon. I'm super excited. I'm going to be doing so much content on this game because it feels incredible. But thank you boys for watching. Catch you boys in the next video. Peace out.